After winning their first game in the African Cup of Nations qualifiers, Nigerian Super Eagles travel to Morocco where they face Sao Tome and Principe. Can they get all three points and make it six out of six in AFCON 2023 qualifying campaign? We'll have a look at the highlights. Uh, Nigeria versus Sao Tome and Principe. As usual, subscribe if you have not and click on the notification bell to get more updates. T3, the road is already underway towards the next tournament in the Ivory Coast just uh, four months after. Well, a proud moment for uh, everyone connected with the team today. Comes in the number eight and also a start for uh, Luis Siliman, the number 15, who is expected to partner the experience that Luis Lailed and Terry Moffi of the French Ligue 1 club Lorient will partner. So we're underway then here in Agadir as uh, Nigeria touched on towards Moffi. It's nicely done. Victor Ozimhen, the offside flag comes up. I'll tell you what, could be a close one. Rosimhen, the uh, Napoli. Let's see how uh, tight a call it was. In support of him, the uh, fullback continues his run and win the break. One back by Lukman. And now the ball through towards Moffi. Alert goalkeeping from. Saidu Sanusi down the line for Moses Simon. Simon with a terrific ball in and it's headed into the net. Victor Rosimhen opens the scoring. A goal that's been coming practically from kickoff today. And Moses Simon, who set up both goals in Nigeria's opening win against Sierra Leone once more. He is the man with the assist here today. Jose Pizero's team with the ideal start. Perfect cross from Moses Simon. And nodded into the net by the Napoli striker, Ozimen. A player who you have to say they really missed at the AFCON in Cameroon at the beginning of the year. As he uh, recovered from having served. Moses Simon cleverly lifted forward looking for Moffi. It might just fall for Lukman. Just a disappointing first touch for Adimola Lukman. The pressure's still on. He will be back into the middle. Ozimen again maybe but the offside flag is up. Well... That time he was indeed offside, no question marks on that occasion. Moses Simon sets off on the run, brilliantly done. Cross in from the left, looking for Aussie men once again. Nations in Cameroon. He will be, gets it back to Lukman. Adimola Lukman here, can he get the shot away himself? Blocked bravely by the defender. Ronaldo Viegas to the rescue for Sao Tome and Prince, but the pressure's still on here. Moffi, Aussie men in the middle, turn behind for another corner. And the pressure on the Sao Tome and Prince defence is uh, relentless here. Moffi. As then again waits in the middle. Moffi might fancy a shot himself here. Really well struck. And stopped by Anastasio Briganza on that occasion. Saltame in principle goalkeeper. One of uh, a number of players in the, from the Moses Simon cross inside the first 10 minutes. And he could be away again. Here Ozyman once more. The offside flag has come up again. Offside call. Terry Moffi. And uh, Ozzyman, the two players, going to in front of the goal line as the corner comes in. And brilliant stop by Anastasio Briganza in the Saltome and Principe goal. How on earth did he keep that one out? Could so easily have been number two for Nigeria and number two for Ozzyman. From the goalkeeper, just uh, with the foot planted in the ground. Some uh, rather unsavoury incidents 
in the stadium at the end of the game with fans invading the pitch. Ozyman, Ozyman to make it two. It'll be turned in surely by Moses Simon. Ozyman returning the favour and Moses Simon who's been making the goals so far in this AFCON qualifying campaign now gets on the score sheet. Now then, chance maybe for the shot from range. Well, it was powerfully struck, but off target. Simon feeds it through to Ozzie. And then again, and once more, the assistant referee raises his flag on the far side, coming to the rescue for Saltome and Princip. Ozzie men on that occasion again, very tight call, but he was just a fraction ahead of the last Athletic uh, season finale. Murphy giving chase, Murphy round the keeper and Murphy still into the middle, surely no. Oh, Nigeria should have been 3-0 up, Terry Murphy going against them. Terry Murphy round the keeper. Managed to hold off the uh, attempts of uh, Anastasio Bre Here they come again though. Murphy in this time maybe well struck but straight at the goalkeeper who makes the block. Collected by Moses Simon. Nigeria looking for the third before half time here. Mitebo well struck, blocked the claim. A surprise result today. It's always going to be a challenge for them. They conceded the early goal and uh, they have been on the back from the Nigerian defence. Get it away and picked up now by Victor Ozimhen. The Napoli man looking for Terry Moffi in the middle of fine ball through. Moffi to make it three. Excellent finish by Terry Murphy and he gets his goal this time. And the third goal before the interval that Nigeria had been searching for. They are on easy street. At the end of a breakaway, the Santomi and Principe were maybe hoping to keep things as tight as possible into the interval, keep it down to 2-0 just exposed themselves a little bit and they were uh, caught out at the other end Aussie men feeding Murphy and Aussie men following up his opening goal with a couple of assists first one for Moses Simon and now one for Terry Murphy of Lorient in the French and Thibault inside to Ajay Nicely worked to uh, Adimola Lukman now. Lukman across the face of goal and an easy finish. Nodded in by Victor Ozyman, his second of the afternoon and Nigeria's fourth. That goal applauded by the sprinkling of spectators in the stand here in Agadir. Well, Aussie men is having quite an afternoon. Forget about the goal disallowed for offside. He has now scored twice either side of a couple of assists. And all that, of course, off the back of netting what proved to be the crucial goal in their first game against Sierra Leone in Abuja. Playing his trade in Bolivia. The other four all play in the domestic league at home, including three for Ray Amador. Adamola Lukman. 1-2 with Terry Murphy in the final attempt on goal. Well over. And here's a shot at goal and it's a brilliant goal too. A fantastic strike to make it 5-0. No chance whatsoever for Anastasio Braganza in goal. And Ogeni Karaway Tebo. with an absolutely tremendous hit well they enjoyed that down on the Nigerian bench and they're enjoying their afternoon today just outside the penalty box and Itibo's effort crashing in off the underside of the bar and playing the holding midfield role today and joining in when it comes to putting the ball in the net too it's a different challenge but 
He's in excellent shape, but his uh, team at the other end being ripped apart time and time again. Aussie men thought he had his hat trick. The offside flag denies him. Victor Aussie men already had a goal ruled out for offside in the first half. Well, he's a brilliant finisher. He just needs that service. He was ahead. Oh, it's a bit of a short back pass from Calvin Bassi, nearly pounced upon by Luis Leal. Now then, Ahmed Musa. First involvement for him. The substitute with the captain's armband on lays it back and ball into the near post, tucked into the net by Terry Murphy. And that is six nil. And a second goal of the afternoon for the L'Oreal striker. Well, it's like a training exercise, really, this for the Super Eagles. They are cruising this afternoon here in Agadir. Mohamed Musa playing his part, having just come off the bench, and it's uh, Zaidu Sanusi, the number three, who sets up the goal. And an easy finish from close. A table across to Ahmed Musa on the far side. Comes uh, inside Ahmed Musa. Unselfishly picks out Moffi. Might just fall for Lukman. It's number seven. And Adimola Lukman joins the party. Oh, they're running riot today. Ahmed Musa had already played a part in the sixth goal. And... Uh, he played a huge part in making that one. Uh, Sal to me in Princip would have come out in the second half hoping to keep the score down as much as possible. But the golfing class is just too big. Premier League star Lukman pouncing to finish after Muffy had been uh, thwarted by the goalkeeper. Anastasio Braganza has made a, a few very important saves today. There's been a couple of disallowed goals too. Well, Nigeria showcasing their attacking strength here. Ozyman is in again. Ozyman for his hat trick this time. Surely it's 8 0. Well, he's had an outstanding afternoon, Victor Ozyman. He could have had his hat trick uh, already. Had he not been denied by the offside flag and there was never much doubt that he was going to run through and finish that one. The flag uh, staying down on that occasion. He went underneath the goalkeeper this time. And the Napoli man. Nothing in that, according to the officials. He will beat uh, Itebo. up by Lukman. Lukman getting it back from Abdullahi. Abdullahi for Terry Muffy. And then Muffy picking out a teammate on the edge of the box and it's drilled towards against Sierra Leone for today. This time no question of the offside flag coming up. He was just about in line. Great ball through by Ahmed Musa. Perfect first touch, and then he steadied himself before lifting it over the goalkeeper. Saltami and Princip would have been hoping that Nigeria just. Well, Dennis seemed to go down in installments, but he was caught there by Jardel Nazare, the defender. The referee got a very good look at it, and uh, surely it will be Victor Ozimen to step up no it's going to be Dennis the victory today Emmanuel Dennis tucks home the spot kick right at the end of injury time they have been utterly rampant the Super Eagles Victor Ozzyman may have been the star of the show but all his fellow attackers have joined in so there you have the Nigerian Super Eagles, six points out of six that they are beating Satomi here in Morocco. I'll see you guys in the next one. Enjoy your day.